Okay. And he, there's our there's our friend Trevor Pendleton. No doubt. Ruminating on the terrible gravity of the fact that he's had his own brothers killed. Oh, who am I kidding? He's probably laughing his ass off. <laughs> Let's see what he has Orvo, to say. The Loyalist Conspiracy thanks you for your work. I don't know if I can. My own brothers. We never believed that you killed the Empress. It made much more sense that the Royal Spy Master, now the Lord Regent, was behind it, aided by some of his key allies. We spent a lot of money and exposed ourselves He's to great risk in getting you out of prison. <laughs> but we did it because we believed that you was all that aristocratic difference. inbreeding, probably. Oh, and Havelock's looking for you. It, it takes its toll after enough generations. This game really does have beautiful lighting. Yeah, I'm actually really impressed by it. I, I don't, I don't think the Unreal Engine is one of those ones that's really renowned for lighting. So I'm pretty impressed that uh, that it looks this good. I'm trying to find a find a way up because I'm too lazy to just take the extra couple of seconds to walk, basically. It's, it's like real life. I was going to say, this is why, as I said previously, I should never... I shouldn't be trusted with the blink power in real life. Because, like, my legs would just decay into sticks and fall off from a lack of use. <laughs> I don't look around right now. Something's going on here. Of course. Here. We can give you the tour later, when you've rested. I was wondering... Do you think my mother is really dead? I saw her get stabbed, but maybe she was still alive and got better. Is that possible? I'm sorry, Emily, but no, she did not survive. Oh. Did you go to her funeral? Was it fancy and beautiful? A train of carriages rode through the city. It was very beautiful. Flowers everywhere. And thousands of people wept because they will miss her. I wish I could have seen it. I'm sorry, dear. I don't like to think about what it would do to your psyche to see your I mean, mother stabbed in front of you when you're eight. Well, but I like it better anyway. You can see the tower Probably turn across the Batman. from here. That's where my mother died. Although she was Sometimes shot, I wasn't she? About the man who stabbed yeah, but my mother. we now have the plot for who Dishonored 2, I think. Ah, uh, yes. So I get to stay in the smaller tower while I live here. That'll be good practice. Lady Emily like is the Dark Knight. Like Perhaps we can take another boat. Lady right Emily, soon. played by Christian Bale. <laughs> is my mother still alive? I've been planning for Emily. We're so close. Lesson plans are together. A schedule is prepared. We will make life. Although he'll probably be dead by then. The horror she has seen. But all that's almost over. Now is my time to show my worth in this coalition. I knew this was why they brought me here. Well, Miss Godwin, I see you've come to die way. with your city. Superstitious. <laughs> 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 oh. Alright, the fugue feast, I've told we've talked about that previously. Oh uh, yes. Call to the spheres, we've seen that too. And I'm just gonna steal from Emily's room now. She was saving for a pony. <laughs> <laughs> oh she's a princess, she can afford it. Powdered oh, I wonder where that powdered crystal is exactly. What? Powdered crystal. Uh. Whoop. Got quite a nice view from here. It's got a pretty good draw distance, though I don't imagine you can actually go over there. Yeah, I'm sure there's a limit to how far you can go. But yeah, in general, e even with stuff that like, you know, that actually is in the environment, the draw distance is, qu is pretty impressive, at least on the good settings. I mean, th this game does, like, you know, good-sized environments really well. You just can't figure out where to go, can you? So many choices. I've... Like I said, these were... This video was originally recorded months ago, so I'm 
trying to reconstruct my thought processes as I'm just dicking around aimlessly on the rooftops. <laughs> just exploring, really. Ah. Now for a nice refreshing drink. Elixir have reached a critical low point. Ordinary citizens will be limited to purchasing half a dose per day. All right, my friend. Martin's devised our next move. There's a footnote in Campbell's journal that tells us the Lord Regent's mistress sat for a portrait with Sokolov, the painter and royal physician. He'll be able to give us her name. Sokolov lives on Caldwin's Bridge about half the time, out over the river. The catch is that I'm afraid you've got to head out right away while Sokolov is at his apartment on the bridge. Samuel can get you close to the bridge, but you'll have to find Sokolov. Bring him back here intact, and it'll enable us to make our next move. I can't believe what you've done so far. Escaping from Coldridge, taking down the High Overseer, recovering Emma. You make this old military man proud. That's it then. All this sneaky tre treason makes a uh, military man proud? Well, Havelock just enjoys the violence, really. Remember the thing about how he kills men and whales for profit and pleasure? Yes. He's got eccentric tastes. Let's hear Pendleton... Oh, no, we don't have another one of Pendleton's bitch fests about the Boyle women. That's disappointing. <laughs> Is all the Pendletons had a uh, thing against them. Yeah, that's true. There's three of them. There's three boils. You think it would work out okay, yeah. <laughs> Have like log entry three. Pendleton was willing to go further than I thought. He served up his own flesh and blood to the cause, and I can see that he's truly loyal to the Empire. Could I have done the same if my brother was still alive today? Probably. Undoubtedly. Many innocents must be sacrificed for the good of Dunwall. Every loyal watchman that falls beneath Corvo's blade is giving his life for the Empire. Yeah, so... Symptoms must be reported. No exception. Booner songs. Damn it. Pardon? Oh, you missed the chance to read Harpooner songs. I know we've probably gone through it before. Yeah. Nick, hold on a second. I'm going to I'm going to pause this a second just so we can catch up. Okay. Well, no rest for the wicked just yet. Two missions yeah, in one day. I forget. Have we uh, upgraded yet? Uh, no, we haven't been by Piero's yet. Okay. I, I'm afraid of what horrors await us there. What, you know, steam-powered <laughs> devices of sexual... <laughs> excitement. Sexual gratification. Ask me for any gear you need. He's just... Ho <laughs> I, I just want to complete this transaction and get away as quickly as possible, Piero. I'm sorry. Bone charm capacity... Being able to carry more bone charms is nice. Swimming in coins. Yeah, I have quite a bit here. That superpower is really. And as I've said, I, I've, in my experience, I've, I've almost never need have reason to need to buy ammunition or potions. Quite a bit to choose from. Crossbow accuracy. Crossbow range. Turn your pistol into a shotgun. It's um. I read that right. That was dispersion and he stabilizes pistol aim. Yeah, you can have your pistol 
fire multiple times before reloading. Not up to the capacity of, like, a modern gun or anything, but... It'd be cool. Whoa, you just blew through, like... Yeah, I spent a lot of money there. Spirited. More, slightly more mana. And that'll do for now. See what... Dare we find out what's upstairs in Piero's apartment now? Do you know something? Oh. Man, no new audiograph. This is a complaint I have about video games in general, but I've never seen a, like, a comfortable looking video game bed. <laughs> I don't think I have either. Off to Caldwin's Bridge, sir. We'll get our sleep later. Just climb aboard when you're ready. Alrighty. We're off to Caldwin's Bridge. I'm not sure if this is named after the Empress or her father. Hmm. I don't know if they specify. Maybe they specify at some point, but... Do you think you can... Does, does it raise and lower? Uh, I'm not sure. It looks like it does in that picture, doesn't it? Yeah. Those are the coolest bridges. It's like that one in Inception. I've never seen Inception. You need to see Inception. I've heard it's good. It's quite possibly my favorite movie. Really? I'm sad to say that I've seen it over 30 times. Wow. What do you think, Corvo? Here we go. Caldwin's Bridge. You've been in the city for years, but you lived in Dunwall Tower with the late Empress, so maybe you haven't visited the bridge before tonight. Something to look out for. See all them lights on the water? That's right. We'll be spotted for sure. You're gonna have to shut off their power before I can pick you up. Now, about bringing Sokolov back alive, he's smart. Maybe even smarter than Pierre. Got the whole of Dunwall under his thumb with all that natural philosophy. Just business. snapping photos again. I, technology, potions, and the like. I had neglected. Some I didn't realize that the sound was getting picked up by the recording know? software at the time. Here we are. I'll meet you at the arches under Sokolov's place when you're ready, Corvo. Assuming, of course, you've taken care of those floodlights. So, can you carry out the rest of this without? Without taking out the floodlights? Apparently not. I don't think he'll I don't think he shows up for the extraction until you do. Uh -huh. so yeah, you gotta get those lights. I know, I know. But if we do see someone, then what? We say something? Remind him about curfew? No. You don't remind him. You chase him down, and you give him a severely deadly beating, is what. Okay, yeah, I got it. Ain't no point in yelling at me. Severely deadly beating. Uh oh. Speaking of severely deadly. Citizens and visitors to our city. By order of the region, the curfew is now active. No foot traffic is allowed across Caldwin's Bridge until curfew is lifted. Outsiders' eyes. Attention, all citizens. No yeah, it's a it's like a curse word. Is allowed along Caldwin's Bridge during this period. <coughs> curfew will end tomorrow morning at sunrise. Just a you know religious oath. Did you ever read Harry Potter? I have not. Oh, check this out. This is pretty cool. This is my slow-mo ability. Up oh, you go. Off you go. And I'm out of here! The perfect crime. Yeah, the slow-mo ability is a lot of fun. 
Now, if you get it all the way upgraded to the second level, which I, I don't do in this playthrough because it's really costly, but if you get upgraded to the second level, it stops time completely. Ah, uh, the fish! Yeah, the, I'd forgotten about the deadly fish of Dunwall. You don't want to spend too much time in the water. Individual bites don't do a lot, but they can get you a bunch of times. You can possess the fish, right? Yes, you can. Is there's there a, a part to it? Uh, there, there are. You can swim. You can swim through certain places, actually. Uh, yeah, yeah. Sorry. <clears throat> yeah, you can. Uh, actually, back in the uh, previous level, the uh, Golden Cat, you can hmm. sneak in from the outside into the basement by swimming through a hole in the water outside to the that like lets you surface in one of the like steam baths or something. Interesting. And disturbing. I yeah. Never want to. Never want to sit on a toilet in Dunwall, basically. Yeah. 